In this demonstration, we will cover how PSpice provides a unified design environment using device model interface feature for multi-signal simulation. In the era of Internet of Things, billions of devices are getting connected to each other every day. For example, in a smart house all the electrical appliances are connected to a smartphone or a tablet, and you can access all these appliances while sitting hundred of kilometers away. With technology costs going down, IoT is the current big thing in the technology industry. Microcontrollers, sensors, power and energy management, and analog and mixed signal components will heavily use mixed signal simulation in the coming years. Wearable devices, such as smart watches and activity trackers. Computer peripheral devices and touch screen devices are some of the examples of Internet of Things. To be a leader in this era, you need to have a unified design environment to simulate various type of models and perform different analysis modes, such as stress and reliability. For the following models, PSPICE and Advanced Analysis Technology, using PSPICE Device Model Interface feature, provides state-of-the-art circuit simulation and verification solution to create the unified design environment. The models can also be used at the following abstraction levels. To use the PSPICE Digital Model Interface feature, select DMI Template Code Generator in the Model menu. The PSPICE DMI Template Code Generator window provides you various options to generate a template model plug-in code for the different DMI models. When the plug-in code is combined with the user code, you can generate the required digital C or C++, system C, analog, and Verilog A, DMI models. Let us now generate and simulate a digital C or C++ DMI model. Select interface type as clocked. Enter the port details using a CSV file. Once the CSV file is browsed, the port details are displayed in the port entry window. If required, similarly enter global parameters details. Once all the required information is complete, click OK. Once the lib file is generated, you can see its details using model editor, .lib, Visual Studio project file, and other related CPP and header files are generated. Open the Visual Studio project in Microsoft Visual Studio, and change the default build configuration to 64-bit. Update the project underscore user CPP file with the user code that contains logic. Edit PSP project H file with some extra variables and build updated DLL file. After the DLL file is built again with changes, use the export to part library option to create a capture library. Once the capture library is created, add the new part in the capture design. Run piece by simulation on the design to get mixed signal simulation results. In this demo, we covered that Internet of Things requires unified design environment, and how PSPICE provides that environment. We also covered about DMI feature, that provides advanced capabilities for multi-signal simulation.